Mini moguls, aspiring apprentices, or future presidents? For now, Donald Trump's grandchildren are just cute kids. Oldest granddaughter Kai is just a year younger than Donald and Melania Trump's son Barron, which meant she was more than old enough to enjoy the perks of having a grandparent in the White House. You know, things like attending official events, riding in the presidential helicopter, and sitting in the Oval Office chair. Kai was born to Donald Trump Jr. and then wife Vanessa back in 2007. Her mom told Posh Cravings that she didn't know the biological sex of her baby, but still felt confident in decorating her child's room in a teddy bear theme. She also admitted that her pregnancy took a toll on her body, telling people, I didn't expect to be so tired. People told me in the beginning, you have a lot of energy, but I was exhausted all along and had to force myself to take a rest. These are the two most important women in my life. Donald III was born in 2009. While there's not much public information available about Don Jr. and Vanessa's oldest son, he has popped up in the news from time to time. In March 2017, Secret Service agents who were charged with transporting the youngster were called in for questioning after they took selfies with him as he slept. As reported by Mother Jones, the incident happened while the agents were driving him into Manhattan. He reportedly woke up during the selfie sesh, and as the outlet noted, he freaked out. These days, he enjoys chilling with his family in Florida and hunting and fishing with his dad. Ivanka Trump and Jared Kushner welcomed their oldest daughter, Arabella, in 2011. Her proud grandpa was happy to announce the news, telling Fox and friends, I just left the hospital and the baby is beautiful. Ivanka's doing great. Arabella Rose is the baby's name. I just found that out, by the way. Have fun, okay? Great job. Arabella was able to enjoy a lot of Donald Trump's time in the White House, but there may have been a few tears along the way. In 2019, she suffered a head injury while playing a version of dodgeball, as her mom shared on Instagram stories. Yesterday, Arabella slipped playing Gaga and hit her head hard. Thankfully, she is fine. Arabella has been enjoying life in Miami, Florida with her family since Grandpa left the Oval Office. Don Jr. announced the birth of his son Tristan in 2011, tweeting, Mom and baby doing great. He can't wait to meet his big brother and sister. While Tristan's life has been kept pretty private, Don Jr. did open up to Daily Mail TV about his concern for his kids' safety during the heated confirmation hearings for Justice Brett Kavanaugh. He told the outlet, I've got boys and I've got girls, and when I see what's going on right now, it's scary. Don Jr. and Vanessa welcomed baby number four, Spencer, in 2012. The proud papa told people at the time, I'm thrilled. The baby is healthy and beautiful. Don Jr. was a little more chatty about Spencer on Twitter, where he shared the inspiration behind his son's name, posting, Spencer, because we liked it, Fred after my grandfather. While they keep his daily life private, in 2018, Vanessa revealed on Twitter that Spencer was about to start kindergarten. More recently, he can be found on his dad's Instagram hanging out with his family. Ivanka and Jared celebrated the arrival of their son Joseph in 2013 with Ivanka tweeting, We just welcomed a beautiful and healthy son into the world. Jared, Arabella, and I couldn't be happier. Joseph and his cousin Spencer share the middle name Frederick, in memory of Ivanka's grandfather, Frederick Trump. Joseph was also named after his grandfather on his dad's side. Ivanka told people, Jared's grandfather, Joseph, was a rock. His indomitable spirit, his sense of family, and his work ethic are the values we hope to hand down to our son. Chloe joined Don Jr.'s gang in 2014. At the time, her dad tweeted, It's a girl. Vanessa and I are very excited to be bringing home our little bundle of joy today. Full house. Like the rest of the grandkids, Chloe has skirted the limelight, but she and her siblings make occasional appearances on their mom's Twitter feed. In 2019, Vanessa posted, Happy fifth birthday to my princess Chloe Sophia. You always make everyone smile. May all your dreams come true. We all love you. Twinkle, twinkle, little star. Ivanka and Jared welcomed their son Theodore in 2016. Ivanka confirmed the baby news to people, sharing, Jared and I are thrilled to announce that we'll be welcoming baby number three to our family early next year. It's an incredible blessing. Arabella announced to everyone I was pregnant prior to me announcing it to even my family. Her whole nursery school class was congratulating me. 
Little Theodore doesn't get a whole lot of press, but the Daily Mail reported in June 2022 that he enjoys going to the beach with his family in Surfside, Florida. Eric and Lara Trump announced the arrival of their first child, Eric Luke, in 2017. As the BBC noted, then-President Trump shared the news on Twitter, writing, Congratulations to Eric and Lara on the birth of their son, Eric Luke Trump, this morning. Apparently, he's got more hair than most babies. So. The Trump hair. The Trump, yeah, the Trump hair. The couple shared the news with People in March 2017, with Lara noting how she had been handling the reality of the pregnancy, revealing, It surprised me because I'm a very active person, and until the fatigue hit, I didn't believe it would actually happen to me. Best known as Luke, these days he enjoys hanging out with his family. Carolina became grandkid number 10 in 2019. Dad Eric announced her arrival, tweeting, Laura and I are excited to welcome Carolina Dorothy Trump into the world. We love you already. Laura also celebrated the family's news by sharing a photo of a newborn Carolina on Instagram. Laura and Eric were open about how they thought older brother Luke would fare with the new addition. And as Eric posted on Twitter in April 2019, Laura and I are excited to announce that we will be adding another member to our family in August. Luke will be a great big brother. While all the grandkids likely got some of that Trump fam charisma, Carolina's clearly the biggest ham of the bunch.